December 30, 1903. Over 1,700 people eagerly entered the newly opened Iroquois Theater in Chicago. The theater was a sight to behold, with 60-foot-high ceilings, white marbled walls, and grand staircases. The Iroquois had just opened five weeks earlier, in November. Men, women, children, and teachers gathered over holiday break to see a musical comedy, Mr. Bluebeard, which featured actors masquerading as animals in an over-the-top live performance. What they didn't know was that one-third of them would not survive that fateful afternoon. <laughs>